Hi guys, today we are going to be unboxing Universal Yums. So I have Stephanie here with me. She lives in the RV park I work at. And she's my friend, like my bestest friend here. And uh, so this is Kesley Vlogs and we're going to be unboxing Universal Yums. We're super excited and we're kind of nervous, to be honest. <laughs> A little? <laughs> so today we have Universal Yums from the Ukraine. I had to, I had to like look up what they spoke because I was like, is this Russian? Because I've already looked, gonna, I've looked in the box. <laughs> Are we going to be able to pronounce some of the names? I don't, oh, oh my gosh, this is like a little cheat guide. I didn't even know what this was. Okay. The food's in here and I guess the, I guess we can go by this. Okay. Let's do that. <laughs> okay. Okay, so first we have a potato and onion potato boom. It really doesn't make a whole lot of sense. It potato and onion potato boom. So let's find that in here. Ooh. This. It's actually like full size product. I thought it was gonna be like samples. Oh this girl. Wow, off. they're like full size products. This is potato and onion potato boom. Okay, so this is onion flavored. <laughs> or be kicking in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do they give so, me two of those? So that's a different flavor. Okay. That's veal. Veal and a jika, whatever that. <laughs> okay, so let's try this. Are these in English? Are these, oh, the no. ingredients are oh, in English. Yeah, they put that sticker on there. Oh, well, I'll try to look. And it tells you the, part of the protein, the fats, the carbs. That's good to know. Yeah. What do you think it smells like? like a sour cream and onion, kind of. It kind of smells like sour cream to me, I was gonna say that. Okay, cheers. <laughs> oh. They're kind of stale. <laughs> They're real stale. I sent me my box late. <laughs> How late, a month late? <laughs> what do you think? They have a good flavor, but they're, they're a little stale. I don't know. I, I like, like them. I've had. It always reminds me of scalloped potatoes, <laughs> like the sour cream and chive ones. Yes, I like them. They look like little fries. Yeah, they're okay, but they're a little stale. They're really stale. So, rate one to ten. From ten being the best. Yes. Probably a two because of the staleness. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say a three. <laughs> so the two. Okay, on to the next one. Okay. <clears throat> okay, this is should be good because this is Russian creme brulee chocolate, and it says it's milk chocolate with creme brulee filling. And I Ooh. just had my first creme brulee in Vegas, and it was freaking amazing. Good. He he ordered it, and I was like, yeah. it didn't look too great. <laughs> it was really good. What actually. restaurant was this at? Um, Fogo de Chao, I think it's. Fogo de Chao. There's <laughs> a Brazilian stickers. Oh, okay. Oh, the one you were talking yeah. about. Yeah. Fogo de Chao. Something. Uh, something like that. I can't remember. Let's find this. I think I had one in the cruise one time. Oh, it's good. I think. I don't remember. It's just, it's just oh, it's kind of fancy. Oh, it's fancy. Milk chocolate. Okay. I'm really impressed that they're sending you. Well, you can start opening <laughs> You're just like taking a no, I'm impressed that they're like sending you like full products. Like, look at this box, y'all. Look at this. Yeah. I'm making a mess. Like, maybe I should have got a knife. Oh, that caramel just came straight out. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> I'll let, take me in. let me take the middle because it's small. Oh, Lord. Oh. Look at these, y'all. <laughs> okay. This looks good. Cheers. This is going to kick me out of ketosis. Cheers. <laughs> oh, bless your heart. I forgot. <laughs> it's okay. Mm. Mm. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I should have gotten that. <laughs> this is good. This kind of tastes like those caramel filling ones. You know, the ones. I feel like it tastes like I don't really chocolate covered cherry yeah. without the cherry. I don't taste the chocolate as much, actually. 
Like, I think I taste more of the caramel. It's like weak chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Pretty good. I'd say, I'd say it's pretty good. It really reminds me of a chocolate covered cherry. Without the cherry. No, it, do, it does. With filling. Without so, the 1 to 10, I'd give this an 8. I think I'd give this a 6. 6? Just because okay. it's so much. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's really good. I, I, I need it again, just around a napkin. Yeah. It's good. If it was in the grocery store, mm -hmm. I'd probably buy it. Me I too. like Hershey's more, though. I do, too. I'd rather have Hershey's. Hershey's is more of a chocolatey taste. This is a weak chocolate. Yeah. Yeah. That makes any sense. It's more of a filling taste. Yeah. Okay. So, Let's on to the next one. All right. If y'all know what I'm looking at, we have questions back here to ask <laughs> so we don't forget. Look at this. It is so messy. <laughs> okay. I feel, like like, you, oh. I feel like you need to be sitting down somewhere with like a childproof for this kind of chocolate, you know? Yeah. Not for kids. And no. I don't taste creme brulee. That tastes just like... I don't taste creme brulee either. Feeling. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. So now we're going for our dill and sour cream golden chips. Ooh. Which sounds kind of American-ish. Something we'd have here. So dill and sour cream flavored potato chips. And I don't know what they got going on. Why looks, it's in a box. Looks like a kid's box. <laughs> it's like a little kid's snack. It looks like, yeah. I've never seen chips. I don't even know how, what I'm supposed to expect out of this. <laughs> okay, we're gonna break all the chips <laughs> trying to do this. Oh, how well done. I wonder if we can pronounce any of these words. Oh my god, it's not even like letters, they're like symbols. <laughs> Is it an H or Y? And Stephanie speaks fluent fluent Spanish. Yes. And it that just baffles me because she has no accent. <laughs> I do sometimes, me. and when I'm nervous, I do. So I. Are you nervous now? I don't hear one. No, I'm just so hoping like. <laughs> Not I stay a with bad thing. I'm just saying. <laughs> I didn't even know you spoke Spanish because you don't have an accent. <laughs> so I had to ask you. This is the weirdest chips I ever did see. Look what at this. I like smell them. Like normal, I think. It kind of tastes like a dried oh. cracker. Why are they? I mean, it looks like a dried cracker. <laughs> They smell like potato chips. Like yeah, what? but why, they're like in sleeves. <laughs> it's just weird. This is long. <laughs> it's like a noodle. <laughs> like a like a um, lasagna noodle. <laughs> so <laughs> yes, let's just make some lasagna with them. <laughs> they taste like those ones in a can. Pringles. <laughs> Pringles. Yeah. They dill. literally taste like dill pickle Pringles. Yes. <clears throat> okay. I like these. I like these better than anything so far. These. These aren't I stale. I would buy these. These are not stale. I would buy these at the store. Yes. I would too. I like it. And it tastes like Pringles. It does. That's pretty cool. I like it's the packaging. Of, it's weird. It's <laughs> very weird. It's kind of like less of a <laughs> saltier Pringle. This has more of a not to, you know how, yeah. you know what I mean? Like these are both, both sides are flavored. I hate when Pringles yeah. only one side's flavored. And you're just like licking that one I side. Know, like, like, <laughs> let's put this side on the tongue. All right. So it's Losty Curd Waffles, which sound disgusting, but they look kind of cool. How would you rate these? Oh, I give them a nine. I mean, it's not the best snack I've ever had, but it's, I buy it. I think I'd give it an eight. I like it. I just, I don't know if I like the little kid packaging. Even though I know that has nothing to do with it, but like, <laughs> you know. It's hard to open without breaking yes, them. Like, yeah. you're in the car, you have to like, <laughs> and you know, so. But I like them. I like them out of, of the other two. I like them a lot. Yeah, I do too. Yeah. So, Slosty Curd Waffles, they look like vanilla wafers. Not vanilla, is it vanilla wafers? Yes. Wait, no. No. You know the. You know the little wafers that look like this that have chocolate, the vanilla, banana. Butter? Oh. You know what I'm talking about? I know you're talking about, I don't know the name of it. Sugar wafers, I think. I think. I don't know. 
So wafers with cheese curd and chocolate flavored filling. Cheese curd and oh. wafers. But... Did I you <laughs> look at this? This is just doesn't look so good. It's just look kind of. Oh, look at like right. What is that? <laughs> is that a, like a chocolate Twinkie filled with cherry? Okay, let's try. I, I have All no right. idea what to expect. Slosty. They look a little old. <laughs> Like the chips. <laughs> no, look, the edges, you know how when you know something's old, yes. the edges are all crumbled, like crusty. They're probably like, we're I'm just gonna send this girl in America. <laughs> They're bo her box a month later. Oh, they're really messy. I washed my hands, I promise. Oh my gosh. They do look like those. Yeah, like the sugar wafers. I think that's what they're, God almighty, I'm gonna I do not the like the smell. <laughs> it smells like a chemical. It smells really strong. What does it smell like to you? <laughs> like a cleaner and it chocolate. Like a, it smells Mix. like a chemical. I just don't know. Should we cheers to this or no? Oh, I definitely want to try it, but maybe no cheers. <laughs> okay, no cheers. <laughs> I don't know if I like the smell. <laughs> Too. Like the smell and the taste do not match each other. I think the smell may be the cheese. Maybe. Because it's like really strong. Like some sharp cheddar, but not. Okay, yeah. I like them. Or you know, I, I do like these. They taste good. You know, like, um, what's that, what's that cheese with the holes in it? Swiss. Yeah, it's, it's, oh, it's real like it's strong. So strong. Mm -hmm. It could be this. I don't know. Who knows? I give it a six. It's pretty good. I give oh, it like an eight. You do? Okay. Yeah. I do. I like it. Right. I like those kind of. Yeah, the taste good. The smell kind of throws throws y'all. The smell is weird. <laughs> it's like a <laughs> chemical. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the next page here. So we have Vil and Ajika Potato Boom. Ah, this Potato Boom, that has got a weird name. Yeah. I don't know what Ajika is. It's Boom supposed to be like boom, like right in your face. Or <laughs> so this mildly spicy sauce is made with carrot and Ajika Potato Boom. So Ajika is made with, is a mildly spicy sauce made with carrots, tomatoes, garlic, garlic and chili pepper. So I how Bill would taste on the chip. So let's, let's go for it. These all been surprising. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the smell. Oh, Lord. <laughs> like somebody's <laughs> grilling or something. It's a little strong. It's probably like, like refried beans, like the smell when they're cooking. To me, I don't know. Like yeah, this was like refried beans to me. What does the smell come like? What comes to your head when you smell it? Like onion gravy. Ooh, like a strong onion gravy with a bunch of garlic and onions. Girl, all I smell is my mama cooking refried beans. Well, my mama don't cook refried beans. <laughs> she don't know how to do that. <laughs> okay. All right. A super stale too. Just smack like heavily smack. Just I don't. Know. I don't like these. Mm mm. Mm mm. <laughs> your water. It tastes like a roast beef. And it's rare for me to say no to food, but oh, it tastes like or, a roast beef. This tastes to me like super stale dried refry beans. <laughs> I don't know how you got refried beans out of that, but it just tastes like refried beans to me. Even the smell, I guess. I rated it like a one. Okay. I give it like a three. It tastes like beef, like roast beef. 
roast beef. Like Arby's roast beef. Like super concentrated. <laughs> <laughs> super roast beef. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't even know how to pronounce this. Let's you, move you go, on. You go for Let's this. move you on. This, this word here. Oh, girl. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> girl, I already. Show day. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Show day. Show day. Show day. Cinnamon caramel chocolate. Oh, that sounds good. It's a milk chocolate with cinnamon caramel feeling. It's gonna be good. Oh, it's kind of like that one. Other one. All right, let's do caramel this. cinnamon and dark chocolate. That don't sound bad. Okay. Oh, and it kind of just not. Are they like oh, individual? Oh, I guess it's a Christianity. Practice Christianity currently in the middle of Great East. So what does this have to do with Christian? It's the like Christian form. <laughs> Edit that out. <laughs> Confession, no one is eating this chocolate in Ukraine. To be clear, these chocolates are extremely popular. Just not right now. So we're the first ones to try it? <laughs> you see, over 75% <laughs> of Ukraine's practice Orthodox Christianity and are currently in the middle of the great, of a great fast. Oh. It's like lit for them. Well, that's kind of cool that it tells you that though. Like it's a little yeah. Like, so background. we used to eat them, but they're 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 practicing Lent. So oh, I like their packaging. This looks pretty. That's cute. Like it. Let's not drop it's it. It's better than. Let me show them that other chocolate they got. Oh yeah, that's all. It's better than up. this one. But they're like little individuals. I like how they're already they're already like by themselves. You don't have to break it open. Oh yeah, I do like this packaging. It's got a cute little symbol. I'm not really a symbol. Oh, I do like their packaging. It's super cute. All right. That's <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're fine. I cleaned the table. <laughs> I'm so sorry. No, you're fine. So let's cheers to this one because it looks cute. Cheers. It does look cute. And I think this is dark chocolate. Dark chocolate. Oh, I do like this one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like a little bit of cinnamon. Oh, I give this a tang, girl. It's cinnamon, a little bit, but the dark chocolate is good. It was like milky, like melty. You know, it was like really good. What's the what's this chocolate? Like the Godiva, how it kind of melts. Oh yeah. In your mouth. Yes. That's good. I think I give it a ten. I give it a ten because the packaging was cute. I give it a nine. Okay. Because I like milk chocolate more than the dark <laughs> chocolate. I it's love me. dark chocolate. <laughs> so definitely, I, I like that one better than the last chocolate. Yeah, it was better than the last yeah. one. Yeah. Okay. You want to move Would on? Would you buy it? Yes. I buy like three of them. <laughs> <laughs> I like. It was just so cute and yeah. Yeah. I buy it again. That's cute. Okay. Yeah. Um, the creamy deluxe toffee, toffee squares. squares, soft milk toffee. This one. Yeah. Yes. I saw them doing this one on the video and it's like, looks very messy. Like I should have prepared and got us some, and we got some trusty scissors here. So I'm gonna throw you these. We need them because of our nails. <laughs> <laughs> it says that it's one of the best toffee in the world or at least in Ukraine. We'll see. We'll see, yeah. Oh my gosh. I can get it open. Girl, it's like, Comes in these little squares, you gotta break them all. Look at that. Okay. I don't even know what to think about this. Mmm, it smells like a Werther's. Oh, it smells, it smells like. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's super soft. Yeah. It's not I like hard. that. Yeah, it is not hard to come, take apart either. Yeah. I like that too. Okay. I like it. Here we go. Let's try it. No tears? <laughs> cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Ooh, very melty. And very soft. That's good. You know what it reminds me of? What? <laughs> you know, have you been to Lado Kenya? Mm -hmm. Yes, I've been there. You know, have you ever, like, their caramels that they have? Lado Kenya. That white sheet? No. No? 
La Nortenia is a uh, tamale factory here, and they have this this like cone, and it has caramel in it, and then it has like a pecan on top. You ever know? I think I know you're talking about, but I don't think I've like had them before. I've seen them. Okay, just like that. Just like it's like a whole yeah. ice cream cone full of this. <laughs> it's like, it was like really rich, but no, pretty okay. good. I give it a nine. I give it a nine too. Because. A little something more. I see some sea salt on it. No, yes. No, like, yes. <laughs> I give, yeah, I give it a nine. I like how it was super easy to come off. It's not sticky to where, like, you touch it and it's like melting in your hand. Yeah, but it it's not real sticky. Yeah, yeah, my fingers aren't sticky. At no, all. Okay. but it melts in your mouth like it's just like it belongs yeah. there. <laughs> you know? I liked it. I give it a nine. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I give it a nine. It belongs there. Your turn. <laughs> Uh, this is probably not how you pronounce it, but salute, 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 ham and mustard puffs. Oh, <laughs> and this is coming in the biggest bag we got. <laughs> this is kind of huge. It is big. It's like almost as big as my face. And I, I just want to, I just want to learn how to say all that. Give it a try. Canut, salute. <laughs> so, so the wrong. I don't know how this C became an S. Oh. Can hot? See, it looks like can hot. Yeah. But it's really salute. 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 <laughs> Maybe this upside down V is an L, and the C is pronounced like an S. Salute. Wait. Oh yeah. So ham and mustard flavored corn puffs. <laughs> and they're still talking about mass of so mass and lint over here. Do you know a lot of, like, about Ukraine or anything? No. <laughs> I don't either. Or that's, I was like, maybe, are they really into religion? I don't know. Because we've been reading a bunch of Christian. These look kind of like little mini pups. They are, but they look less like, like, orangey. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> they just, like, couldn't, like, hello. <laughs> so they're, like, corn puffs. It or, smells like ham. Or cheese puffs. Cheese puffs, cheese puffs. Yeah. they're like half the length. I can smell the ham in them. It smells like straight up deli meat. <laughs> Does. Okay, let's go. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, almost. <laughs> I want another one. I do too. With the it almost tastes like. Like, I'm thinking they look like mini corn dogs, and they kind of taste like mini corn dogs, but in a puff form. Yes, like a puff with a mini corn dog. Okay. I want some Valentina That's in weird. here. Gotta be good some. with some Valentina. I have some. That'd be good. Oh my gosh, you, your Latina's come. <laughs> oh, I didn't um, start eating that until I got here. The Valentina? Yeah. Girl, it's good. Ooh, and then like, Break. <laughs> We're back with some Valentina. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are just looking for Mariana. She loves Valentina on it on everything. Everything. Her Cheetos. Pizza. Everything. <laughs> yes. She's she's gonna do some videos with me too. Oh, let's try it. It'll probably like make a cracking sound because that's what it does on pods. Really? Yeah. Is that safe? <laughs> Yeah, it just means it's getting wet. With Valentina. Do you like it? Mm, that's good. Is it? I'm telling you. Girl, I'm going to do like a little this hot This is dog. Mexican hot sauce. If y'all didn't know what Valentina is. I'm going to show you the label because it's really good. I didn't start eating it until I got to Texas. But we have it everywhere, you know what? Oh, that's good. It's good. That is really good. You I can like save that. this for other for other <laughs> snacks. <laughs> oh, what if we do it on one of the stale ones? You wanna try it? Well, you don't like the veal, so let's go to the yeah, let's onion. Go. Or this is the first onion one flavor. Let's try it. You go first. <laughs> this is like <laughs> Universal Yum's remix <laughs> with the Mexican. <laughs> okay. Thank you, ma'am. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. 
Wait, add some Make Martin Tino. Make these still crackers. <laughs> Make these still so crackers gonna just eat <laughs> with some Valentina. <laughs> and with Valentina, my rate goes up. My oh. rate goes up. <laughs> we but, got a 10 now. Yes. 10. <laughs> oh, I like that. Oh. Is this Sade? Oh, yeah, I think they did misprint it because look, the chocolate has the same print. Is it? Okay. They're, they're messing up. I'm oh, missing something else. <laughs> Look at <laughs> <not>. that. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is dark oh, chocolate dark with chocolate. candied fruits. Oh, it looks so pretty. It does. It looks like flowers on there. Looks like it just came out of bakery. Anthony's over here too, to my left. <laughs> He's probably hungry. Smelling all these. Snacks. <laughs> Told him I was gonna cook after our video. <laughs> so we shouldn't be passing them that way. <laughs> We're not. <laughs> Give him the cell chips. <laughs> he can't hear us. He's playing this game. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know what fruit it's what. It's so colorful. Let's take it. Let's show y'all out of the box. Does it tell you what kind of fruit it has? Oh, yeah. Chocolate with dried oranges, lemons, and raspberries. I kind of want to try some a little bit of it. Oh. Mm, break this bad boy. I never really thought about lemon and chocolate together. Yeah. Have you? Mm -hmm. Oh, you know. What? <laughs> like, the <li> <laughs> like the little chocolates you get like in the assortment. It's got the lemon filling. What? what? Like Valentine's Day. Like you know, they have orange and lemon and strawberry inside. No, girl. No? No. That's like some cheap chocolates <laughs> that you get from Walmart. <laughs> I bet they're good, though. They're pretty good. I mean, I'm having trouble. <clears throat> it is very pretty, though. It is. So, I'm going to try this piece. It smells like dark chocolate to me. Yeah, you probably will be able to taste no kind of candy. I mean, not candy, some fruit <laughs> on here. I love dark chocolate, so I don't know. It's like some strong, how do you say it? C-A-C-A-O? How do you say that? C-A. You know how it's like 100% C-A-C-A-O? Cocoa? Cacao? Cacao. <laughs> Cacao. I don't know. <laughs> you know, hold I've on. never known how to pronounce it. Neither have I. I actually Googled the difference because there's two words that are similar like it. And me not being from here didn't know that there was two like two words. You know what I mean? No, being from here. What do you mean? <laughs> like America? <laughs> You're from Mexico, girl. I didn't know that. Yes, girl. You were born there. Edit this, but yes, Spanish or English is my second language. Oh, you blow my mind right now. Really? Yeah, I thought you were born here. No, girl. I was born in Mexico City. Oh my gosh. Okay, back. Edit that. <laughs> yes, I, I'm legal. That's what we were talking about. <laughs> and that too. That <laughs> no, and that too. <laughs> so back to what we were talking about. We just had this off-camera conversation, sorry. Okay. But we don't know how it's pronounced. Cacao or cacao or... Cacao. I'm gonna go with cacao. I like cacao. I think that sounds good. How about y'all comment down below? Oh my god, what I name my cat that. Cacao. Ooh. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Anthony won't let me name the cat Sushi. He don't like that name, but this is... I like how it has the little... I kind of want to lick these off. The little... On the back. The little... Um, symbol. Cool. Grow up. Mine's all broke. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. But I love dark chocolate. Mm, mm. <laughs> it's like, I can definitely taste the, I, I didn't think I would be able to taste the fruit, but I could taste the fruit. I can taste the orange. I can't taste the lemon or the raspberries. Or maybe I got one with a bunch of like orange on it and not so much. Let me bite it over here because there's some more raspberries over here. Okay. 
What do you rate it? Girl, I rate it a 10. I love dark chocolate. Uh, yeah, I'm rated a 7 because <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of dark chocolate. Oh, I like this. But it's very cute. I like the way it looks. It's kind of like a Valentine's look. Mm -hmm. mm. It kind of reminds me of those chocolate covered berries you get. You know, what are they called? Brookside berries? Um, cherry berries? No, this no. is like you buy at, um, you know, like CBS. <clears throat> While we're at CBS, they were there. <laughs> I don't know. They're like dark, dark chocolate covered blueberries. I really like these. You can have it. Let me see the car at home, girl, because I'll sit at home with her. <laughs> oh, it may not be that bad because it's dark chocolate. Well, 16 grams of carbs, but for one third of a bar. That's a pretty big bar. Yeah. Yeah, half of a third, six. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm out of toasted, but. No, okay. I like that a lot. So I'd give it a nine. You give it a nine. And I, I would buy. A, I would buy. Would I say it. a six? I yes. give it a six, and I would not buy. <laughs> I would buy it again. Okay. And I said it's similar to Brookside mm -hmm. berries, yeah. dark chocolate. Okay. Okay. Our next snack is golden chips, aspic, and horseradish. What the heck is aspic? <laughs> Aspic has been popular for centuries and is an important culinary and is an important culinary tradition in Ukraine. <clears throat> but what is it? It doesn't look really good. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's like jelly. Oh. Meats. Yeah. Oh, my God. Meat jelly. <laughs> I told you it looked like meat. Oh, my God. I just now seen the picture. I had a glare. Show them the picture of it. Oh my gosh, jelly meat. No thanks. But I'm gonna try it anyway. But and see it's that packaging. It's again. that packaging idea, but this I like the packaging. I think it's It's cute, but what if you're dry? You know, I know never mind. <laughs> I thought you were about to say what if you're dry No <laughs> What if you're drunk and trying to have a snack? That's like what a pretty you know. Oh, what if you're driving in? Yeah. So this is meat jelly and horseradish, which I hate horse. No, I don't hate horseradish. What is the sauerkraut? What I hate, never mind. I'd rather have sauerkraut than horseradish. Really? Mm -hmm. Sauerkraut and a hot dog? Oh my gosh. So I can't get past it. Is it just too I've strong? I've only had it one time in my life and I, I almost like threw up, so. <laughs> and it's just like the other ones too. I think it's such a big mess. I'm glad we got hardwood floors now. Valentina to this. <gasps> oh, wait, let's eat it first. Okay, let's try it first. Oh, I don't like the smell. It smells like meat. Oh my god, like it smells canned, like potted meat. Like canned meat. Yeah, like buying it. I don't like right. it. <laughs> let's try it anyway. <laughs> oh my god. Tastes like canned meat to me. Like that canned ham. Spam. <laughs> That's what I was just yes, thinking. Yes. What's that to Valentina? I'm gonna give Anthony all of these. <laughs> Does he like it, Spam? I don't know. I'm gonna add just a tad bit and see if I like it. I'm gonna add a lot to cover up that spam. <laughs> mm. Oh, I like it better with Valentina, but I still can't get over the spam. Spam. <laughs> <clears throat> it's very salty too. Very, very salty. What do you think? <clears throat> mm. I wouldn't buy them, but um, I give it like a four. I don't know. What's the Valentina four? Maybe like a. With the Valentina, I'll give it a five. Maybe you like have a to two put otherwise. Stuff, but like, <laughs> I gotta eat it. But it's just too spammy. Yeah. <laughs> and very salty. Very very. It's spammy, salty, right? Yes. Yeah. 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 I, like, I would not buy them. I wouldn't either. Maybe if I was like starving. And I give it a two. Mm -hmm. If I was starving and I didn't have anything else to eat in the kitchen, uh, I'd probably go to that. 
Valentina. With, if I had <laughs> Valentina. Okay, and then we have Ukraine's Yum Bag. And we have like, it's like this little bag of, of uh, candies. So we're gonna open it and it has different ones in it. One's assorted fruit and caramel. And then one is fruit gummies with juice filling, which Anthony will probably steal later. <laughs> like the level of gummy. And the one is barberry flavored hard candy. I don't know what a barberry is. Still the toffee. That's what I got. Yeah. My orange. I'm purple. Blue. Okay. Blue. Oh, great. Blueberry. Oh. Is it blueberry or grape? Blueberry. Okay. <laughs> Mine's peach. Okay. Let's try. I don't smell anything, do you? It smells spam on my fingers. <laughs> oh, what about chocolate? They, they look cool. They do. They look like those. Look like a big word. Yeah. It's not as, as chewy as, what are those like squared ones that look like this kind of? And they're like super hard and chewy. What is this? Or no? Girl, I don't know. I like that. It's like, it's like a caramel, like a wordless caramel, soft caramel, but it has like a hint of fruit flavor. Like the fruit's not that powerful. It's it might not. Like it. No. And the peach is really good. Like the peach went well with the caramel. Which is weird. I would never. It's very weird. Put both together. But it's not so overpowering the caramel that the caramel's still there. Yeah. Or caramel, okay. whatever. That's good. So we did a caramel one. Now we got the Russian ladybug. Ladybird. Ooh, ladybird. <laughs> but it looks like a ladybug. A packaging. <laughs> it does. It's kind of cute. I like it. Ooh. It is a ladybug. Why does it say ladybird? Cute. Is that what they call them? Do they call them ladybirds? Look at this, it's like a little ladybug with something in, inside of it. Oh! <laughs> it was clean. Okay, I'm kind of excited what for is this, this one. Does it oh. tell you what flavor? No. I'm gonna guess it's lemon. Yours is probably green apple or yeah. watermelon. <laughs> I'm really excited for this. Should we just eat all? <laughs> The filling. <laughs> I like these, but the feeling's like. <laughs> did yours just like shoot out of your mouth? No. Mine did. Mine was like. That's <laughs> <laughs> pretty good. It tastes like. Like a it's, a. it's like the texture of a gumdrop, but without the sugar. What like are a, those fruity snacks that come in like a little package and there's a lot of them in there? Aren't they fruity snacks? Yeah. And sometimes they're like Scooby Doo ones. Not fruit snacks. It's just, I guess it's just all fruit It kind of tastes like, like Welch's. <laughs> <laughs> yes! It kind of tastes like a jumbo one. Like, of those yeah, like a big one. With like something in the, like a little jelly pot in there. And they were, I like yeah, it. Yeah, it's pretty good. I liked it a lot. I actually like the caramel more though. Did you really? Yeah. Now this is Barberry flavored caramel kino, whatever that is. Oh. Forget all the berries you're familiar with and get ready for a new one. Barberry. Yeah, because I ain't never heard of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look how pretty this is. Oh, it's like a very pretty. It's pink. so pretty. It's like see through pretty, really that pretty glass. pretty in the camera. But. Oh, definitely berry. <laughs> it's kind of like a fake berry, though. <laughs> what do you think? I don't think of anything it tastes like, but I can't, I can't really. I'm getting a watermelon taste now. Hmm. I don't know. I, don't, I can't place the taste. I can't either. Does it say? Mm. But it's not bad. I mean, it's good, but I just, I've never had 
Carberry, so you can tell that it's something I've never had. Oh look, the bear are, in addition it leaves the plant as a ruby, berries that have been used for centuries as a powerful natural remedy for infections, indigestion, and heartburn. That's pretty good. I like if I could cure my indigestion and heartburn and stuff, I could probably just pop eat one of these. <laughs> Anthony needs them. Yeah, he had heartburn earlier. I do like it. It's different. It's like a weak taste of. It tastes like a berry mixture. Something. Like with water. Mine tastes like watermelon. Oh. I'm getting like a berry watermelon. Like watermelon. No. Hmm. But it's still pretty. <laughs> so now we have one more left. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was good. Would you how would you rate this one? All three? I would probably say a nine on all three. Like I would eat all of them. And I would I'd probably buy all of them. They taste good. You know, I like that they came in one bag and there was like very of them. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. I really did. And I think I'm going to give it. Pack. Yes. Cool. Yes. <laughs> I like variety packs for everything. I think I'm going to give it a, probably a nine. Yeah. I give it a nine. Mm -hmm. And I would buy it. I would definitely buy it again. Okay. So this is our last one and it doesn't have, it didn't have a, like a little story on it. But it's <laughs> caramelized peanuts with puffed rice bar. It looks like a, um, like a payday kind of. I'm gonna try it. I'm not really big on paydays though. I hope, it'll, I hope it's better. You know, and they have a Mexican candy like this that I've never, I don't think I've ever, like, oh, I want this, you know, like grab for it. So older people like it. Not not to be offensive. <laughs> <laughs> like, older people love paydays. Probably, you know, it's probably one of the first candies or something. Yeah. But aren't paydays a little softer too, though? I don't know. We'll see how soft it is. <laughs> Very shiny. Very peanutty. Like a payday. You're not, you're not allergic, are you? <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay. Oh my god. Very sweet. I love the peanut brittle. Yeah, it does, I remember. But not as good as like homemade peanut brittle. No. Like a, a store bought that I would never buy a homemade peanut brittle. <laughs> This reminds me of a very cheap, cheap version of a peanut brittle. Yeah. Mm. I give it a one. I'm not. Mm. Like, I'll eat this again if I'm starving. I like starving. peanut brittle. Yeah. But, um, I like the candy part more than the actual, like, peanut part. So, okay. this is, like, too much peanut for me. Yeah. I'm going to give it a four. I'm give it a one. Okay. I got about it again. <laughs> I kind of like like peanuts, so I do I like it. Oh, but I give it a four. Okay. Very cheap though, like a cheap version of a. So now we have to decide which was our favorite. Of okay. All of them. Oh, look through. I think your dog's supposed to do these. Get back in there. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly, I honestly like the potato boom with the Valentina. I think that was like my favorite. Yeah. And mm -hmm. next would be the yum bag with the candies. So what's your favorite? My favorite, like originally without the Valentina, I'm gonna have to say the um, dark chocolate caramel cinnamon. Those were good. These are really good. And then my second favorite would have to be the probably the puffs with Valentina. Like, that was so yeah. good. I take my answer back. These were better. I forgot. Yes. I forgot. These Those, were better with the Valentina. Yeah, I definitely. I would I purchase want more them. Right yes. Now. <laughs> I would purchase them. Does it tell you like how to purchase them again? That'd be kind of cool. I would purchase that again and definitely put it <laughs> like in a bowl in Valentina. Let's take one more for the, for the road. Yes. We're about to end this, so. Oh. Girl, I'm gonna get two. 
Oh! <laughs> I do kind of like a little, like a sandwich. <laughs> I'm just gonna like ketchup. This is not working out, but two. These are really good. I like them. <laughs> I like them a lot. Okay. Mmm. Heck yeah. Mini corn dog heaven. <laughs> Heck yeah. Heck yeah. I oh my god, I'm gonna start eating Valentina with mini corn dogs. <laughs> That is good. Eat it with puffs too. They're good with puffs. They kind of like that too. It's really good. Not sponsored. <laughs> <laughs> no, I liked it. Okay, so we'll say this is our favorite with the Valentina. Yes. Hands down, Valentina. Yeah. These are pretty good. I'll have to send her home with some. <laughs> <laughs> send me some with a bag. And I'll put like Valentina to it up. I definitely like that. Yeah. But for something sweet, I think the dark chocolate was one of my yeah. favorites. I love dark chocolate. Though. I actually like that little, this thing, my bob. I don't even. This, oh yeah, the little wafer thing. It smelled like medicine. Not medicine. Cleaning chemical. Cleaning chemical. Yeah, but I still can't. Good, yeah, I still can't get over the smell. I wish like the smell. I wish the smell was a little. <laughs> not so chemically, but I like yeah. it. This was fun. This looks fun. I'm so glad that she came over to do this with me. <laughs> So thank you for watching Cat Sleep Vlogs and this was our Universal Yum from Ukraine.